Well, happy Saturday, human beings from the planet Earth. Uh, a little bit of information I stumbled across that I think is worthy of you taking the time to ponder, research. Uh, this headline is a little disturbing. We're preparing for a massive civil war, says DHS informant. So I'll read a bit and link you to it. Uh, in a riveting interview on True News Radio Wednesday, private investigator Doug Hagman said high-level, reliable sources told him that the U.S. Department of Homeland Security, or DHS, is preparing for a massive civil war in America. Folks, we are getting ready for one massive economic collapse, Hagman told True News host Rick Wiles. We have a problem. The federal government is preparing for civil uprising. He added, so every time you hear about troop movements, every time you hear about movements of military equipment, the militarization of the police, the buying of ammunition, all of this, they, DHS, are preparing for a massive uprising. I'm going to stop there. The link will be below so you can read the full post, but I want you to consider this. I hear a lot of bickering back and forth amongst everybody about the Occupy movement, the anonymous all these movements one side says that that's all created by the corporate elite another side just says that they gotta keep pushing and pushing and pushing to get what's right now does it really matter if the elitist brought us here if this is all by design or does it matter if it's just natural osmosis of humanity when they're oppressed to the degree that we are. Does it really matter? What matters is you need to wake up and see that we're here. Massive protest all over the globe. And if we want to just focus on this country, almost every major city occupying everything for every reason under the sun, and they have a right to. We've been violated for too long. I could give a shit about whether they tried to create this to destroy their own system, or if this is a natural occurrence because we have an illegal regime running our country and we have for God knows how long. It's probably why Kennedy died. Okay? It doesn't matter to me. What matters to me is that we're here now and if you can't see that we're on the edge of a massive civil war, a massive collapse, or whether it's created by the opposition, the powers that be, or if it's just naturally occurring because people actually still have a backbone and will stand up for what is right. I could give a shit. All I know is that I'm here right now and all hell is going to break loose. And for you people that want to call me a fear monger, some of you trolls, very few of you, because your psychology doesn't work here, but nevertheless, if you want to throw the fear mongering. Let me tell you something, you fucking morons. Fear is a needed component, just like love and truth are. If you didn't fear anything, you'd be dead by now, and you wouldn't even be seeing this video. Fear tells you when you hear the rattle, you don't pick up the objects that it's attached to. I'm talking about snakes and other things. If you didn't have fear, fear needs to be controlled it needs to be put in its place but if you're scared at the information I give you then maybe you've been asleep just a little bit too long to everybody else much love and thanks uh, I can't say enough uh, much much love for the shares the likes the comments uh, try to get to most of the comments if I've missed your comment know that I probably did at least read it um, may not have gotten back to respond I'll do my best to do that um, but anyway, keep sharing the information. Click the links. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on any of my videos because if you're too damn lazy to read the information, you deserve to your own death, your own consequences. I, I'm trying my ass off, as many are, to share the information. I, I do my best to verify its source, but we never really know but we have to compile it all, compress it all, filter it all, share it all, and eventually enough of us will wake up that humankind will continue after all this hell breaks loose. Anyway, it's Saturday. i got to get moving on with the rest of this stuff. Much love. See you soon. Be safe.